Hello, it is I, back at it once again. Your favorite boy? What's up? You know what, I am back on YouTube so often, I post so many videos, you would think that I do this for a living. <laughs> I don't make money from these videos, you fools. I, I wish though, because I, I put a lot of time and effort into them, so. Now let me just take a second to say, welcome to something I've never done before. Cooking with Jerry. <laughs> Do we have an intro for this? Oh, can we can we play it? Or oh, we already we already can we do it again? Yes, cooking with Jerry. What's up? I'm so hyped right now, cuz so hyped. You know what? I love cooking. Just just not doing it myself. I like when other people do it for me. At restaurants, that is the sickest. But today, I'm switching it up. I'm gonna be the one cooking. And this is a really scary thing. I don't cook often, okay? Are you, are you cereal right now? Was that really necessary? Today for this video, me cooking, I don't think you're ready for this. And I am 100% also not ready, but this is gonna be a fun challenge. And I'm gonna go hard in this mother effing kitchen. Gordon Ramsay, you're not ready for this, you thick boy. I said it. And besides welcoming you to my cooking show, let me also welcome you to my flannel. Hello. This is it guys, summer, I think it's it's officially over. She's done, she's dead. I woke up this morning and it was actually cold. I was chilled and th this is just what happens when I'm chilled. The flannel, I had to break it out. Flannel weather is upon us guys. I'm so fucking hyped. All right, so here's the thing. I'm not the best cook. I have no idea what I'm doing. Not just with cooking though, like I never know what I'm doing. But today for this, I decided to keep it simple. Let me keep it low key so I don't burn down my house. Again, my, my mom is still pissed about the last time. And that's exactly why today, we're cooking brownies, bitches. What's up? And not just any brownies. Fudge brownies. You hear that? Because you can't go wrong with brownies. There's like three steps to follow and they're done. If I f*** this up, I have serious issues. But lucky for me, it literally lists all the instructions and everything I need on the back of the box. So if I somehow mess this up, someone please take me to prison. Send me to Azkaban. Azkaban? More like that ask? Damn. <sighs> someone take this camera away from me, please. All right, woo, cooking. Let's esket it, shall we? Let me just take a look at the back of this box, see what it tells me to do, and you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do exactly what this box tells me to do, and if I still fuck this up, guys, help me out. There's no way I'm gonna fuck this up. It's brownies, it's fine. Heat oven as directed in chart below. Grease bottom of pan. Bake as directed in chart or two, okay, whatever. All right, so very first thing I gotta do, preheat the oven at 350, I think. I think I can handle this. Guys, I did it. She's officially preheating. And next thing on the list that I gotta do is get all of our ingredients together. All right, the things I will need. Three tablespoons of water. That that could be kind of hard to find, but I'll try. Half cup vegetable oil. Ooh, your boy's got that. And last but not least, two huevos. AKA eggs. I also speak Spanish. Your boy's bilingual. Hola, como stir. Bitch. All right, let me get the supplies. First thing, um, let me get a bowl. Do we have a big ass bowl? <gasps> we have many big ass bowls. Yes, this is exactly what I was looking for. This is the bowl that has always been used for brownies in my house, but every other time they were being made, it was by my mom. Let me get the vegetable oil. Boom, vegetable oil. We're feeling spicy today, boys. Oh, God damn it, I just cut my nails. It's gonna be a struggle. Oh, we got it. We got it, boys. Oh my God, isn't she pretty? This is like, this is everything I need. I feel like the real hard part here was for the company to like make this concoction. I'm just the idiot that has to read the back of the box and get the like two other ingredients. Was it two? Three, sorry, three. Oh. Now the moment we've all been waiting for. Oh, I feel like it's gonna pop. Oh, oh, okay, it low key popped. That smells like heaven. Fuck yeah, look at that. I'm already headed in the right direction. Shake it up a little bit. All right, next step on the list. We need three tablespoons of water. Is a normal spoon a tablespoon? I think that's what it is. Fuck. 
fuck it. We're just gonna roll with it. Uh. Oh shit. Ah! I leaked. Gotta restart. I. Half of it missed the bowl, damn it. One more for safety. Steady. Steady. Uh. Suck on that, bitch. And all we used the spoon for was water. So you know what that means? It's still clean. It's going back in the drawer. And the next thing we need is the vegetable oil. Got it. Where's a measuring cup? Got it! Woo! Dang, I am I came prepared. And this is one of those nice glass measuring cups. Yo. This, this thing's kind of dirty. Half cup right there. Thank God it says it right there. Looks like piss. And just like that, booyah, what's good? And last but not least, the eggs. Thank God we just got new eggs. That's what's up. Is anyone else grossed out by eggs or is that just me? All right, I think I found the perfect two. Now one thing I'm proud of is the fact that I actually know how to crack an egg pretty damn well. So, boom. And there's only a little shell in there. Fudge. There's actually a little shell um, damn it! Do you guys see that? Do you see the one piece of shell right there? How does that even happen? I'm a professional egg cracker. How- I don't even know what- Now I gotta fish it out. Oh my god, it's like sinking in now. Oh my god, I think I got it. Alright, look at her now. No eggshells. What up, what up? What the F? And time for the next one. I've never tried to crack an egg one-handed, but there's a- there's a first time for everything. Now how do I- do I just- Lift it. Oh, this is not gonna go well. Boom, just like that. No shells or anything. All right, where's it at? Ooh, which one do I want? Thick boy or mini boy? Does anyone else do this or is this just like a me thing? <coughs> you always gotta go for the eggs first. It's the most fun part. All right, okay. I think we're getting somewhere. Why is it so stiff? Maybe using this whisker wasn't the best idea since all of it is in the fucking whisk. Can you guys see how thick this is? Is it supposed to be this thick? Does it need more water or like, should I throw another egg in this bitch? What do, what do I do? If anything, it does appear to be completely mixed, so that's one good thing. The one problem I have, um, it's all still stuck in this. I think we're Gucci. We got just about all of it off, um, except for that big clump at the tip. Mmm. Yo, I'm on one right now. Now I know they say not to eat brownie batter or cake batter or cookie dough because of the raw eggs, but the thing is, I don't give a f about salmon vanilla. All right, I need a pan. Let's do this. And now for one of the most beautiful shots of the whole video. Yeah, look at her go. Damn, she's thick. Oh, okay. That should be good. And that should also be good when I eat it. Okay, a little over there, a little over there. And now it's time to send her off. <laughs> I'm so proud. It's like I just sent my kid to college. <laughs> All right, how fucking long do these take to cook? All right, and we're off. And the time is up. Let's, let's take a look. Yeah, those are some brownies, bitch. Let me let me get like an oven mitt. Oh shit, that's hot. Oh. Oh man, would you look at that? Those are some mother effing brownies. Whoop whoop. Hell yeah, would you look at that? Your boy made that, and they actually look normal. I'm surprised. I thought they were gonna get burnt or fucked up or something was gonna explode. I don't know. But they actually look edible, guys. I did that. Now let me just cut these up a little bit. Oh my god, it's so salt. So oh god. Oh, that's that's not done. <laughs> god damn it. I thought they were done. It's nowhere near done. That's like, that's batter. Right as I thought that they were done and I finally did something. No. I gave these bitches enough time. They have to be done. Get your ass out here. Woo! Look at him now. Those are done for sure. And it's finally time, baby. What we've all been waiting for, the official taste test. The thing is, I just took this out of the oven and it's still hot as balls, but I have to leave for work in like 10 minutes. 
So I just have to suck it up and do it. I, I could die from this, so give this video a big old thumbs up. Cause I, I could die. Okay, um, no more wasting time. This is probably the moistest brownie I've ever seen. And it's got like a cake type texture. Ha oh, ha, oh, I'm hot. Oh my God, what the fuck? Now that is a mother effing brownie. Hell yeah! Your boy did it. I finally cracked the code. I found the one thing I could successfully make. Oh my God. This is like incredible. I don't even know what to say. I guess I had it in me all along. I went all those years without cooking because I thought I would blow the kitchen up or kill the family pet. But no, look at me now, baby. I'm a chef. Woo, now let me just say, if you guys enjoyed this video and you are just as surprised as I am, give it a big thumbs up and definitely let me know in a comment below if you would be interested in maybe seeing another cooking with Jerry. Maybe I could step the game up, make it a little harder. And besides that, let me just take a second to say, Thank you so much for watching this video and all my videos. I really do appreciate you guys. And I will see you all again soon. But until next time, peace.